Okay, uh, Dr. Cohen, um, you know, you said that you have this wonderful 3D, 3D, I just call it an x-ray machine, 3D x-ray machine, the calm thing, uh, where you see what's going on in the mouth perfectly, you see an impacted tooth, how he lays, how he needs to come out, everything goes faster and better. Question, does that avoid the, well, I'm not so saying tedious, but the nevertheless slightly uncomfortable making of models, you know, molding it, putting it up, <clears throat> taking time. Uh, does that replace that or not? Um, we're, we're getting close to that. Um, it, it does allow us to uh, translate the information directly to our SureSmile um, information, uh, so we don't have to take molds for our SureSmile stuff like we used to have to do. Um, the, 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 the problem that we have is that it sometimes can be costly to make some of these translations from one type of information, one type of data to another. Um, I think over the next five years, we're going to have the ability to, to eliminate the majority of our impressions. Um, but again, the, 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 the financial aspect of it has to make it worthwhile, too. Um, you know, we, we, we in our practice have become pretty, pretty expert at making impressions. We very rarely have anyone that has any problems with it. Um, so uh, it's until we can get something that, from a cost-effectiveness standpoint, is similar to uh, impression costs, then um, it's still going to be kind of a novelty for, for that back. But as I said, there's some companies now that are starting to do that. There's other kinds of scanners that are being used, laser scanners. Um, and, you know, it, it's, it's around the corner, but it's not quite here yet. Okay. Thanks a lot, Stockton. <laughs>